So now this is a case of the, uh, the same type of hair loss that I mentioned earlier. So that's the androgenetic alopecia. Now this one is also related to a genetic predisposition that this client has. And again, she did have some other stressors that were causing that, that kind of like, uh, I would say, tri triggered or on, on max this particular type of hair loss. So what happened is that she had very severe, severe anemia which she um, received a lot of shedding at the time. And the shedding um, is called telogen effluvium. So she had a lot of shedding all around her scalp. Um, and it, and it, was, it went on for about six months before she realized what was going on, that she had to go to the doctor. They had to give her iron, they had to, um, give her iron supplements. And once that, once that happened, once she started getting the shedding from the, the low iron, what, el what, what else happened is that it triggered the androgenetic alopecia to show up as well. So this is what she's dealing with now. She no longer has a diffuse hair loss, the shedding all over her scalp, but she's still dealing with the androgenetic alopecia now um, from the fact that she had that low iron. So one type of problem can cause another in this case. Mm -hmm. In this case, it was the low iron that triggered the shedding, the massive amounts of shedding, and it unmasked um, the genetic hair loss that she already was, you know, kind of like was already there, kind of lurking, but maybe it just wasn't as prominent. And once she, um, once she started having all of that shedding take place, it unmasked it and caused the front hairline to look even thinner than it was before. And this is what she's dealing with right now. And she is also a 50 year old woman as well. And she's using the Neogenesis Serum She's also using the Hair Max laser comb to energize her follicles and to reduce inflammation because she gets a lot of pain, which is very common with people who get um, androgenetic alopecia in the affected areas. They will receive some pain in those areas. She's also using a DHT blocker and um, a nutritional supplement as well, just for all around um, health even just the hair loss itself and not knowing why it's happening or not being able to get the help that you need, that will cause stress as well. So the, stre the, the stress of hair loss can cause even more damage, you no know, more hair loss to um, appear as Good well. Point. I do see, I do see uh, growth, I do, um, compared to where I was where I, and to now, I do see growth which is good. <laughs> yes. So this client also, as I mentioned before, had some other stressors in her life that were causing her hair to fall. So I mentioned um, in the first video that we did, I talked about her health. That was a major concern, specifically her iron levels, right? That caused a lot of shedding and it, and it unmasked another type of hair loss, which was um, which is called androgenetic alopecia. So she's, a, in fact, she was dealing with two different types of hair loss at the time. Mm -hmm. um, and then she was very stressed for different reasons personally. Um, so that was an, a third factor. So she had three different factors that was uh, affecting her hair, about three to four, I should say, four different factors that was affecting her hair. Um, and it made her very sad. Um, she didn't like looking at her hair because it was just very thin. She always had full long hair and her hair was just coming out, um, you know, too much. So once we started managing her stress, um, once I, I, I tried to help her or educate her on how stress was affecting her hair in all areas of her life, because stress shows up different in all areas. Um, it can be health related, it could be emotional stress that she was dealing with at the time. Once we addressed those things for her, she was able to manage her stress better. And then we, I taught her what, what she needed to do to kind of like take care of her hair better at home. Um, once we did those things, she started to see some improvements. And once we added the Neogenesis hair thickening serum to her regimen, she really started to see her hair uh, take off to the point where when she leaves the salon now, she gets so many compliments and that really boosts her confidence because other people started noticing that her hair was improving and looking looking a lot healthier because People will come up to her and be like, oh, my God, what happened to your hair? Why, well, you know, why is your hair so thin? You always have beautiful hair. So now she feels more confident because other people are noticing, as well as herself, that her hair is a lot healthier. So I'm happy about that. And I'm just not seeing the shedding as much as I was seeing it before prior to us using uh, the Neogenesis Hair Thickening Serum. So it's been great for her as well, for her confidence um, and just for her overall health of her hair.